Hey, Mark Nelson here. Today what I want to do is I, I want to share with you how I grow my list using a Facebook Messenger tool called uh, ManyChat. Man, I had a brain fart right there. But what I've done is I'm going to use, I'm going to do a Facebook ad. And this is an ad that I've done and I put it up on my business page. I actually have two pages and, and business pages are are not really, I don't want to say a thing of the past, but people don't use them as much anymore. I shouldn't say that. Um, people use them. If you're doing ads, you need a business page. And if um, they used to be get much more engagement, but right now Facebook is actually uh, kind of trending towards groups because they get more interaction. So I, I want to show you what I've done. And, and I did one yesterday. I actually have two pages. And I did one yesterday that I'm going to kind of share with you and kind of show you how I look at results. Um, so we'll kind of go through that from here. So this is what I do. Um, this is on my business page, Mark Nelson, and I put this ad up earlier. And I, the first thing, it's you can either do a story post or a um video and, and this one is a video I thought I, I'd try that I just did it 15 minutes ago but the first thing I do if you notice up here I ask a question do you have a bucket list destination and then I tell a little story and what I wanted to do is comment below right if I'm gonna get this bigger I said do you have a bucket list destination our next destination is Tuscany Italy tell me where you want to visit in the comments below and then I ask another question. Have you ever not traveled due to not being able to afford it? Give me a yes below. I want them to make a comment, and there's a reason for it. So when I start this video, I think in a video, two things. You need to really, you know, in an ad, you got to stop their scroll. So what I'm trying to do is just get their attention. And then what I do, I put a chat up. You can do it through Facebook. And what it does is some people like to read rather than but read rather than listen to it so again it's kind of a way to get their attention more now here's what i'm going to do and and i really had stopped doing this but what i'm trying to do is again get uh more subscribers on my mini chat list now this is a new page for me and i typically don't do boost your post until i have probably 500 people on here but i'm going to go boost my post and I'll show you what happens here if, if Facebook's going to work. Come on here. There we go. Okay, so the first thing it does, it's, it's going to ask me my objective. Do I want to connect and chat with more? And I really don't want to do that. I want people to see my video. And then I'm going to button, I'm going to leave a button. Um, I'm not going to put the button on there because I, I want something different. Now, Facebook says automatic audience. And I really don't want that. See, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go, I want people who already know me. And it's people who like your page and their friends. And that's what I'm going to go with. Now, they want me to do automatic placements. And what that is, it goes to Instagram. I don't want this to go to Instagram, although the video is probably short enough. So maybe I no, I want just on Facebook. Um, no, I'm going to try Instagram. See what happens. And I just want this to go. I'm going to change this. I want to go five days. And you can put as many as you want. And I, I don't want $10 a day. I only want $5 a day. And generally, if I'm doing an ad, I'm going to do more than that. But since this is a... It is a different ad that I'm doing, I'm going to change it. Now, as I go down, two things are happening. It says we found one error because it's going to... When you, I'm going to actually do a training on this. When you set up a, your Facebook profile, you are given an ad account. Well, I don't want that one. I have a business manager account 
and I'm going to select that one. And it, it wants, it, it gives me my pixel, which was I want. And everything's kind of set up. So that's really all there is to it. There's, there's not much, so I'm going to boost that. And it's going to go. It's first going to submit to it. But when that's happening, what I'm also going to do is, uh, of course, Facebook wants me to. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to ManyChat. And if you don't know, this isn't a training on ManyChat, but that's the, the bot what I use. And what I'm trying to do is get people to reach out to me. So uh, this, again, this is a new channel. I have 60 active subscribers, which means they're on my list and I can start selling them. My idea, my thought pattern, not my thought pattern, my goal is to get more subscribers. So I'm going to hit Growth Tools. And I'm going to go over here. I'm going to go New Growth Tool. And it kind of shows up, see my widget name, I'm going to go just say travel the world, I don't know, and you can call it anything. Uh, but then you get to cha charge what you want. So you can do an overlay widget, and these are to your blog, wherever you want to go. Uh, you can embed a button in your uh, emails to take you to, um, and I am certainly going to do that. But what I want to do is down here. now. ManyChat, like a lot of these, have um, a free version and a paid version. And some of this stuff is down in the paid version. Facebook Ads JSON is really a great thing. I can set up a messenger. It actually gives me my um, a URL I can send to people. I can do a customer chat, Facebook Messenger code. I don't know what really that is. And a checkbox. And that is, if you ever see it on a... You might see it on sales pages that it says check here if you want to get it in Messenger. But I'm going to do Facebook comments. And this says it's in the beta. It's really not. It, so what I'm going to do, it says select a post. So I'm going to go down to publish posts. This was my, so that's the one I want. And here's what it says. It says, I confirm that Slex was that this page is going to contact users by message. Yes. And when user leaves a comment, send message after. You can do it immediately. I'm just going to, you can change it to seconds or minutes. I'm just going to put it to one second. We'll just leave it there. Now, you can ex exclude comments with these keywords. Only trigger for comments with these key. And some people have done that. If you told them to comment, yes, if you told them to do this, then that's part of what it is. But I'm going to go to next. And I think it wants me to save that. Um, so I'm going to go to next. And up here, this is the response. So it says, hey, full name. Well, I can change it to whatever I want to do. But this is what I'm going to edit. And I am going to change that. It's going to, hey... And I just want first name. And then it says, what's my fallback? Uh, which means if they don't have a first name, what are you going to say? Hey, there. Um, and I put it. And I'm just going to... Oops, I did this wrong. I put my... I want my first name there. There, I got fixed. Now, I'm going to ask them a question. And what I want, see what ManyChat does, they don't become your subscriber unless um, you have a, um, they answer a question. You know, I'm just going to say, thanks for commenting on my post. Do you have a, special destination on your bucket list. And so that's my question. I'm going to put a question mark. And then I'm going to ask one more question. 
if you do, comma, has money ever held you back from being able to go? And I'm going to tell them, comment, yes or no, below. Because I want them to say something. i got to spell that better. I don't care what they say, right? I just said, hey, whatever it is, I want them to save. So I'm going to save this now. So it's in. And now I'm going to go to next. And when I go to next, it says don't send. You got sending options. Don't send. Send everybody replies. So I'm going to say send to everybody because that's what I want. And now I'm going to make another message. I got to edit it. No, oh, they want me to save it again. So I save. So I want to edit it. And I'm trying to edit the. So this is my welcome message. I'm just going to say thanks. for commenting. You know, I'm, I'm just going to tell this, but this is a travel option. My wife and I have found a way to enjoy to earning 60% Sixty percent. Where's the percent? I need my glasses on. To eighty percent in luxurious resorts. Luxurious resorts. Would you like to learn? And sometimes I like to put in emoji, so I'm just going to go back up here. This is my emoji, and this is on my Google thing, and I'm just going to put fire because I think that's one of my best ones. And I'm going to copy that, and it should have gone, and there it is. And I give them an option. Click the button. Click the yes button below. Okay, so now I gotta add a button. And some people put, in fact, I'm going to, I'm gonna see if I can find that emoji. I probably shouldn't have done this because it's taking longer. Uh, I'm just gonna put a down arrow there and I'm gonna copy, copy, and I got two of them. And add a button. And this is, uh, Yes, show me. And I'm going to open a website. Now, I believe I've already copied the URL, so I'm just going to put... Nope, I got the wrong things here. So here it is. This is... And now I'm going to go back to ManyChat. And Command-V, and there it is. And now I'm done. So I'm going to add another button. And I'm just going to say, no, not now. And this one, I'm going to send a message. And I got to click that twice and send message. I'm just going to say, that's cool. So I got to get up here. That's cool. Talk again soon. And that's it. So I publish. Now, what people don't do all the time is when I go back to my growth tools, I'm going to just go back here, uh, travel the world. It says it's in draft. So what I have to do is go back and I have to activate it. Now my widget's activated. So anytime somebody goes back and makes any kind of comment, my widgets, my ManyChat widget's going to pop up. Now, 
I want to show you what I did the other day. I, and now this is a different post. I, I Again, I told you I had two different um, pages. So I put an ad up there yesterday. And if you ever want to see what's going on in your ads, you just go back to your business manager. And I'm going to do a training on my business manager uh, and see if that helps. And this is slow right now. It's always slow when you're doing a training on the internet. Always. Um, so here we go. It's going to pop up. This is brand new. And, and I don't know, you know, Facebook ads are funny because you really have to. Um, I have, There's the one I just put. It's in review. And it, as soon as it gets, if, it, if they accept it, I'll get an email. So this is the one I did yesterday. I'm just going to click on it because I want to edit it. But what, when I click on it, what it does, it takes it to away from the campaign to the uh, ad manager, I believe what they call it, or I don't want an account overview. This is the ad set, excuse me. Now what I want to do is I want to go right to the ad and I click here. And as soon as I click here, a preview button shows up. So I'm going to go to this preview. And when I go to this preview, this is my mobile feed. Well, I, what I want to do is I want to do an ad preview because I, I want to see what's happening. And then I go down to Facebook post with comments. And I'm just going to click on that. And it's going to take me to my post. Now, remember, this is brand new. So I don't have a lot of people on here. But some people, when they did their pages, they would do a boost a post to like your page. Well, I go the next step because what I'm doing is I just want to see what happened. And yesterday, it's we have 173 people reached, and then we have three engagements. And I believe the engagements are for me to tell you the truth. So I'm just going to look at them. And what happens generally, if people have liked it, they show up that they've liked your post and made a comment and you can actually click on their like page. So that's kind of a whole different way of getting people to like your business page a lot easier and probably, I think, a lot more effective. So, ah, hey, hey, hey. So that's it. Uh, I hope that helped. Hope you enjoyed that. If you have any questions, please reach out to me. And we will talk to you soon. Bye.